Hello students how are you all I hope you all are fine Today we'll see standard 7th subject science in that chapter number 5 acid bases and salt In the previous video part 1 we have seen up to main 4 Today we'll see main 5 Answer the following questions in one sentence one mark each Each question carry one mark See the question number 1 How are bases to taste and touch Answer is bases are bitter means astringent to taste and soapy to touch Number 2 What are indicators Answer is the substance used to examine whether the given substance is acidic or basic are called indicators again the substance used to examine whether the given substance is acidic or basic is called an indicator number 3 give three names of indicators available in nature answer is turmeric litmus and petals of china rose these are the indicators now see number 4 question number 4 state two indicators used in neutralization reaction in laboratory answer is phenolphthalein and methyl orange are used as indicators in neutralization reaction in the laboratory which two indicators phenolphthalein and methyl orange phenolphthalein and methyl orange are used as indicators in neutralization reaction in the laboratory Now see question number 5 from where is litmus extracted answer is litmus is extracted from lichens litmus is extracted from lichens now see question number 6 state the effect of washing soda on litmus paper answer is washing soda turns moist red litmus paper blue see the effect washing soda turns moist red litmus paper blue see the question number 7 what happens when soap is applied on the stain of turmeric on the clothes answer is when soap is applied on the stain of turmeric see the next page on clothes it turns red generally we have seen that uh, whenever on our clothes if uh, the if the uh, color of the turmeric is trapped then what happen when we applied the soap then it's become a red color if you not observe then next time you observe it see the question number 8 state the chemical name of washing soda answer is the chemical name of washing soda is sodium carbonate number 9 state the chemical name of common salt the chemical name of common salt is sodium chloride see chemical name of washing soda is sodium carbonate and common salt is sodium chloride so don't be confused in between number 10 state the chemical name of milk of magnesia answer is magnesium hydroxide is a present in milk of magnesium now see question number 11 define neutralization answer is chemical reaction between an acid and a base that produce salt and water is called neutralization question number 12 which substance are produced by the neutralization reaction between acid and base answer is salt and water are produced by the neutralization reaction between acid and base now see main 6 answer the following questions in a sort two marks each each question carry two marks now see describe the process of neutralization with the help of an example answer is acid and base 
react to produce salt and water c acid and base react to produce salt and water this chemical reaction is called neutralization again acid and base react react to produce salt and water this chemical reaction is called neutralization example hydrochloric acid it's a acid and sodium hydroxide it's a base react chemically and sodium chloride means salt and water are produced this is neutralization reaction and this reaction is known as a neutralization reaction now see acid plus base gives salt plus water now see acid hydrochloric acid means hcl plus sodium hydroxide naoh gives sodium chloride means nacl plus water plus h2 hcl plus naoh gives nacl plus h2o now see question number 2 why is an antacid tablet taken when you suffer from acidity answer is acidity or indigestion cause due to too much hydrochloric acid released in the stomach on taking an antacid tablet the basic substance magnesium hydroxide in it neutralizes the effect of excessive acid hence it relieves acidity or indigestion now see question number 3 why is calamine solution applied on the skin when an ant bites answer is when an ant bites it injects formic acid into the skin see when an ant bites it injects which acid formic acid it injects formic acid into the skin it causes pain at the affected area the effect of acid is neutralized by rubbing calamine solution which contains basic substance zinc carbonate hence it gives relief in the pain now see question number 4 why is the factory waste neutralized before disposing it into the water bodies answer is the waste of factories are usually acidic in nature see the waste is of factories are usually acidic in nature if they are allowed to flow into the water bodies the acid will harm the aquatic animals see the waste of the factories are usually acidic in nature and if they are allowed to flow into the water bodies means if to allow to flow in the river water or whatever then the acid will harm to the aquatic animals and plants therefore factory waste should be neutralized by adding basic substance before disposing it into the water bodies so first of all what they do uh, first of all they neutralized this factory waste by adding basic substance before disposing it into the water bodies then they disposed into the water bodies then they released into the river or whatever water bodies now see the question number 5 blue litmus paper is dipped in a solution it remains blue what is the nature of the solution explain answer is blue litmus paper is dipped in a solution it remains blue then the solution is either basic or a neutral by nature explanation if the solution is basic see if the solution is basic then it does not cause any effect on the blue litmus see if the solution already become basic then there is no effect on the litmus paper then there is no effect on blue litmus paper on blue litmus paper it means it remains blue only if the solution is neutralized then the color of litmus paper will not change it means it's a neutral then color is not change now see question number 6 state two properties of acid give their three examples see the properties now properties they are short to taste acids see be remember that it's a acid they are short to taste they turn moist blue litmus paper red 
they react chemically with base to form salt and water now example hydrochloric acid sulfuric acid and nitric acid are the examples of the acid now see state two properties of bases give their three example properties they are bitter to taste they turn red litmus paper blue they react chemically with acid and produce salt and water and examples are sodium hydroxide calcium hydroxide ammonium hydroxide see the question number 8 what are neutral substance explain giving example answer is the substance which do not turn moist blue litmus paper red or moist red litmus paper blue they are neither acidic nor basic the substance which do not affect litmus papers are called neutral substance common salt nitrite glucose sugar etc are neutral substance common salt and nitrile are salts while glucose and sugar are not salts yet neutral substance see the question number 9 all the salts are not neutral towards litmus papers explain answer is washing soda and baking soda are salts they are salts produced by neutralization of strong base and weak acid they are salt produced by neutralization of strong base and weak acid so they they have basic property hence they turn moist red litmus paper blue and thus they are not neutral towards the litmus paper so it can be said that all the salts are not neutral towards litmus paper see the question number 10 how can it be known that the given solution is acid or base answer is the solution that turns blue litmus paper red and does not affect the red litmus paper is an acid the solution that turns red litmus paper blue and does not affect the blue litmus paper is a base now see the next question what is salt give its example the substance produced by neutralization reaction between acid and base is called a salt sodium chloride common salt nitrile potassium nitrate are salts both of them do not affect on litmus papers hence they are neutral substance all the salts are not neutral substance and all neutral substance are not salts now see the question number 12 explain the use of neutralization reaction in soil treatment answer is excessive use of chemical fertilizers makes the soil more acidic or basic plants do not grow well when soil is either too acidic or basic when the soil is too acidic it is treated with basic like quick lime or slake lime if the soil is too basic then acidic substance like gypsum is added even organic matter is added to basic soil to neutralize it thus neutralization reaction is used in a soil treatment now we will see the next main seven in the next video part 3 stay safe stay healthy okay bye